Hey guys, Queen of Hearts here and welcome back to another vlog. Today is Saturday. It is 9.33. Um, I've already went to the gym. Okay. Cause who playing? My birthday is coming up in like a month. A month and two days. So, I'm so proud of myself for continuing to work out and not falling off. Um, very, 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 very proud because, yeah, um, so yeah, I gotta make birthday plans. I don't know what I want to do. Um, it's in between a staycation, like a, not a staycation, a, um, a solo trip somewhere or, um, getting up with my friends. So, Yeah. Yeah, I'm on the fence about that. But on today's agenda, um, I am about to go to Tyson. If you're in Charlotte, you already know Tyson is a beauty supply store that has everything that you can think of. I need to go there and get some lashes. I need to get a beauty blender and some lip gloss, I feel like. Or do I want to go to Ulta for lip gloss? I don't know, but I have a client at one to um, do her makeup um, for a wedding that she's attending. So I'm going to um, go do her makeup at one and then I need to hurry up, come home and get dressed. Or I may get dressed before I go over her house. I don't know, but I really don't know. Like the only thing I have on the agenda today is like, um, I know for sure is I need to go to the ATM, I need to go to Tyson and I need to go um, do my client's makeup at one. Then uh, my friend is coming from back home, Anderson. So we're supposed to be getting up this afternoon and who knows because with him, you just never know. So yeah, um, come on, let's go. <laughs> So before I forget, I just want to show you guys what I just picked up from Ulta. Um, I have a Morphe brush. This is what I use to um, this is what I use to carve out the brows. Um, I picked up this Elf brush. It is the concealer brush. So once I put the concealer on, I'll just put it where it's supposed to go, and then I'll go in and blend it in. Um, I put it on with this brush here and then I'll go in and pat it in with one of these. And these were buy one get one 50% off. 
Real Techniques um, sponge. I got one dual ended expert sponge. And then I have another, what is this, face sponge by Real Techniques as well. Can you see? There we go. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and head to Tyson. And then go home, take a shower and change clothes so I can start my day. So let's go. It's Winston. <laughs> when I love one, I'm like, here, please get that one. <laughs> I love it. Okay. you just seen I was viewing an apartment and um, I like this one now I'm just gonna drive around the neighborhood to kind of see what I see I'm also gonna come back here you know at nighttime to see what it's looking like also um, yeah the one I looked at was cute um, it's in my price range um, I'm looking for something like with a washer and dryer for sure. Um, what else? Updated appliances. Um, I'm not too like too set on like hardwood or carpet, although I would like to have um, hardwood. But at this point, I don't think I don't think that that matters as much to me. But anyways, um, yeah, so I'm just about to drive around this neighborhood. My friend um, is here, so um, he got me on call around Charlotte duty to find somebody that got a section. So that's what I'm going to be doing, and um, then I'll be linking with him. And yeah, we'll go from there. So I will see you guys soon. Hey guys, so I just realized that I have not eaten all day. It's 4.56, so... Um, I was gonna go to stir again, but I said, Shay, no ma'am. So I'm headed to, um, I'm headed to Ink and Ivy. Hopefully I can find a spot. I ain't got to pay to park. And we're gonna have us some mimosa or something. Cause it's, it's really pretty. It's really pretty today. And I look pretty, so. I just feel like being outside and that's what I'm gonna do okay period Purr. so that's all I ain't want nothing y'all but um yeah we about to go ahead and get us something to eat might get a little buzz on them uh, you know I ain't know yet but I'll see you soon I'ma get, 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 get you drunk, get you love drunk off my hump, 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 my lovely little lumps, check it out. I drop these drunk as crazy, I do it on the day, they treat me really nicely, they buy me all these ice.
Okay, y'all. So today must be like wedding day because everyone that I've seen, they're dressed up. They're dressed up. And that's all I'm saying about um my feet. But anyways, let me see if I can make any turn. I'm leaving, um, let me show y'all. I'm leaving over here by Ink and Ivy. So yeah, there's a lot of people outside. It feels really good today. So. Hey, uh, I'm not around my car. But anyways, um, it feels really good today. A lot of people are outside taking, you know, graduation photos, wedding photos. It's just a really nice day here in Charlotte, North Carolina. Oh, yeah, that U-turn was nice. But anyways, y'all, let me tell y'all. I've been in... I've been in Ink and Ivy, right? I don't know if y'all saw a dude that walked behind me. Anyways, if you didn't. There was this guy, um, I was sitting at the bar alone eating my salad, you know, trying to keep it cute and, and healthy, but um, he started talking to me literally just on me like COVID not real. I had to put on my mask because, sir, we're not doing that. Anyways, um... Listen, I got a free meal and drinks at the deal, so whatever. But, yeah, Ink and Ivy was cool. Um, I'm on my way home for a little bit until Ross hit me up to get up this evening. And, um, yeah, that's how my Saturday's going. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. That Caesar salad, that salmon Caesar salad from um from Ink and Ivy was so good. <sighs> Y'all, oh my god. It was so good. I added um I added some pepper on top. Can I go this way? Yeah. I added some pepper on top and that was just uh so good so i think i'm about to go home and take a nap honestly and then i'll pop out a little later on it's like 7 12 now so ross will probably hit me around 9 9 30. but anyways that's all guys um i'm feeling good so yeah i need to sleep this off and then we'll see what the night hitting for so i'll hit y'all later peace if you're broken in my business then just shut up my feet is in bottega I'm getting money, get a whole lot of hands. So I just got home and I see I got a package. I don't know if we forgot or we just didn't go pick it up, but the candles that we made last week in Miami, um, I had to call and get it shipped because, yeah, we didn't get that before we left. So it's here, so I'm going to get ready to open it. Let me go get my keys. My name. Oh, it smells good. Oh, Y'all, I did such a good job. I'm actually gonna wait to burn this um, when I move into my new place, but here it is. I got the matte black so it'll match my aesthetic and decor that I'm gonna have going on in my apartment. And here's what it looks like. So pretty, right? I actually named this oh, backwards. I think it's backwards, but it's Queen of Hearts. 
it just smell it smells like um I can't even remember the scent I did but it's, it has like a clean smell mixed with like a woody smell I love like men um, scents and fragrances so this is gonna be perfect like I literally cannot wait to burn this other than that y'all I'm about to go ahead and take a nap and yeah I'll see you guys a little later bye good morning guys happy Sunday um, I think yesterday I left off uh, with the unboxing of my candle that I got back um, I did take a nap I ended up taking a nap for like I think two hours and then Ross hit me and we got up at around 10 last night so I did go out um, and yeah I made it to church what is this I made it to church, so that's where I'm leaving now, and I'm headed to brunch. Um, a few things. So, I don't know if this is normal. It may be normal. Um, but as young as I am, I'm 28. And, like, going out last night, it was cool because I like, you know, getting dressed up being in like a club environment it seemed like played out like I feel like I'm like I would have rather you know been at home working on something or in my bed or you know just comfortably home like I don't know I just was not I don't know it doesn't excite me anymore <laughs> like I, I I was thinking about okay what time I need to leave so I can make sure I'm at church in the morning that type of thing like I was not gonna miss church today and I'm glad that I didn't because the word was so on time y'all it was so on time um, let me tell y'all it was titled an outstanding accomplishment so um, just to brief you guys the pastor was talking about an outstanding accomplishment and when God is you know on the brink of bring, bringing you an outstanding accomplishment that there will be assumptions he will um, there will be an audience around you that you know are discouraging that um, our naysayers but he needs that audience there so that when he transform you they can be an attest to the new transformed you so the message was so good and so on time because after you've been through the fire after you've been tried after you've been tested is when God will prove himself but only when you allow him to be God yeah today's word was just really good um i'm headed back to stir hopefully they don't have a long wait you know sunday is sunday fun day in charlotte and everywhere probably but yeah it gets a little packed like the restaurants just be just be od so it's supposed to be 81 degrees today so i said i wanted to kind of eat outside like Get a nice little patio vibe with some good food so yeah i'm headed to brunch um i think that's all i got for y'all i think yeah i just wanted to give y'all an update on today's service and what it meant to me and hopefully you know this coming week you know if you are if you are battling with a thought, if you are, if you are in the midst of um, a test, just remember that it's God has the final say, and if you let Him be God, God, no matter who's around, no matter what what's being said, the opinions of others, it doesn't matter because God has it all worked out, and it's gonna be for your good. So. Just as I am preaching to you guys, I am preaching to myself. 
but I just wanted to fill you guys in on that. I, I will talk to y'all later and um, yeah, let's go brunch. When a nigga got money, now you done switched up on me Now you gon' say what's up to me Okay, so now you gon' make love to me Girl, if you don't get the fuck from me I know you thought we had something special But you don't mean nothing to me Girl, I'm sorry, you not the one for me Let me honest, girl, what you want from me This ain't nothing, you keep it so one, honey I can't let none of these niggas get one up on me I go back, I tell you, you better run from me Give hold of my niggas, them niggas love money Adios to them bitches, can't get a hug from me I'm high on life, that's what it does for me My numbers going up, I feel a buzz coming Young nigga, young nigga Your friends bad too, then don't come with you And we like Bitch, you put they on shit, you don't like go dig it Guys, so happy Monday Yes, I forgot to close out the vlog Yesterday, I think after brunch yeah, but um, I just wanted to come on here and say that I hope you guys have a great prosperous week. Um, I hope that we accomplish and knock out some goals this week, that we are nice to people, that God gives us opportunities and that we're ready for them. Yeah, that's all. So I just wanted to come on here and say I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to another weekly vlog with me don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys